How's it going out there? Welcome from H2 Tech Video. Today I want to show you how to reset your Galaxy Note 10.1 2014 edition <laughs> back to factory settings. And we're going to make it real easy for you. We're going to walk you through all the steps. First you're going to do is go to your menu. Just tap right there. Go to settings. And we want to go to the general tab. From there we're going to go to backup and reset. And then the option at the bottom is factory data reset. Reset all settings and delete all data on device. Tap on that. Then you're going to tap reset device. It will ask you again because it wants to make sure this is exactly what you want to do because you cannot undo this. We will tap delete all and it will shut down the device and from this point you've done all that you need to do. Uh, from this part it could take anywhere from 30 seconds to about five minutes depending on how much data you have on the tablet. It's going to erase all your stuff off of there and then it's going to basically set it up like it was when you first purchased it. So um, this part again doesn't take long and the way you know it's complete is you'll be back at the welcome screen where it will be saying welcome and you'll basically be choosing a language. That's how you know you've successfully factory reset your tablet. So we're gonna take a second here. I always like to just show the whole process just so you know exactly what it's supposed to look like. And in the end, you will have your tablet uh, fully reset. Now the reason you would wanna do this um, one is if you're selling it, you don't want to sell it with your information still on there, or if you decide you want to return it, upgrade it, whatever. You don't want to give it away with all your personal information, your accounts, your emails on there, because why would you want someone to have access to all your personal information? Or you may have pictures on there, uh, blah, blah, blah. It's just a safety precaution to make sure that um, all of your personal information is safe. Okay? So we're just about done here. Probably be a couple more seconds now and it will be complete. By the way, this tablet is pretty amazing. I currently have the Note 8 inch and um, kind of feeling like I want to get this one. Sucks. I'm tired of buying new tablets, but this thing's amazing. So uh, hopefully, I'll be able to post some videos, kind of show you some of the. Uh, cool features on it but has a great feel to it same backing just about as the uh, note 3 phone so this is such a great compliment to have both devices you'd be able to do a lot I'll add this part out that they even that's not to share between each other, remember? What? Because mm -hmm. it's thanks to your Samsung's cloud account. Also, there it is. We are here, and the tablet has officially been reset back to factory settings. Hope you guys did find this helpful. Uh, just another note, if you do have the uh, Galaxy Note 3 phone as well, uh, there's actually um, there's a cloud feature that will allow you to share your notes between the phone and the tablet. So it is such a great compliment if you do have the phone as well as the tablet. So anywho, again, hope you guys found this helpful. Make sure you like the video if you did find it helpful. Subscribe to HU Tech videos and keep watching. All right, have a good one.